M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Doing some tests here on the Ulaphone 20 WT walkie talkie, which is analog UHF DMR, and then it's like a normal mobile phone. I think it's Android 11. It's very good, it's big. You know, it's to me, it's a hobby item, it's a, it's a very big item. Um, let's get my hand. There you go, it's got a PTT. And I, I do like it, it's, it's great fun. Um, quite not too expensive, about 250 on AliExpress. Now that I've done some tests on analog, that seems to work fine. Although at the moment, if you want to use a repeater, you have to program it on two separate channels, one for the input, one for the output, which is a bit of a pain. So I'm going to message Ulaphone about that. But now I'm just seeing if if, if you know if DMR works. So what we've set is a, the same frequency on both radios. That's the BT01 Anyto. We've set color code one. And we've set, now you can't set different time slots. So we've had to just leave it on contact group one. So I'm gonna show you the, the parameters of this channel, which is 23. You can name channels, but when you change the numbers, it doesn't show the name up here. But anyway, let's just go to ch channel 23, go channel, scroll up to 23. So you have to sort of count them all. You can, I could have named it, I suppose. 21 to where is it yeah we're on it. it looks like we could be on this is the channel with the tick okay hold it down edit and if you look there we've got we've named it hotspot one i could add the number 23 there so i know where it is if i want receive receive frequency so it's not receive transmit showing here although it does show it on a different menu that it could be transmit but in in reality it's not it's receive receive low power color code group mode you can select group or private look or all so i'm selecting group and then group number one which ties in with one on on the dmr radio there and that's it so you just tick to act to make it use that channel you you hold down the channel that you're going to use like so and you and, and you select activate and it's on that channel then you go back to what they call intercom which is here like so so we're on the channel so let's just we could use the ptt but we're just gonna tap the screen and you'll hear it coming from the dmr radio m0 fxb m0 fxb i need to turn it up and what you also saw is all my, because you can put your DMR number and if you go to device, setting, at the top there's DMR number, I haven't set anything else, just literally DMR number there. And so because there's a CSV file in the DMR radio, it knows what that DMR number means. Let's just check the volume on this. I should have heard it then, so let's just go a bit louder. Do like these BT zero ones. It's, it's Bluetooth connected to my Anytone five seven eight. So let's do it again. M zero FXB test test. Yeah, you hear the echo. Okay, that's working fine. It sounds fine. Let's go the other way. Let me get my hands out of the way. It's going fiddly. So M zero F. You get it. It does work. That's that's my main point there. So, you know, it does work. What I've been trying to do is get it to receive my hotspot. At the moment, not really having much joy with it actually receiving my hotspot, but it is working radio to radio. It does work on DMR, so I thought I'd point that out. And uh, So the things that I would like Ulaphone to do is add the ability to select slot one and two and add the ability to, when you do program a channel, that, because so if you look here, it actually does say, if you look close, it actually does say, let's try and get it to focus, TX, RX. So on this screen, it says it. And if you change it, if, you, if I hold down here, edit, if I change, TX, one of these, it does show it on the other screen as TXRX, but when I test it, it only it only, it only it only works on one frequency. It doesn't but use both frequencies. So that's it really, playing radio, you know me, loads of gadgets on the go here. 
always testing different items out. Bye for now, 7-3, all the best.